And we're back with Mass Effect 2. Dark and Ran still chipping away at the whole Saving the Galaxy thing. Yep. We're almost done recruiting recruiting the squad. Only yeah. I think only Thane left to get to get. And one unknown right. and one unknown member on the on the squad list. Oh my. Also picked up a few loyalty missions. No messages for you, Commander. Shut up. <laughs> it does remind me. Uh, before we, you know, go and get Thane, there's something we can do now. That we ha uh, have Liara. Where's Omega? Hello. What are we here? Scans detect a rapidly decaying derelict ship in orbit above planet Jonas. Registration matches the NSV Broken Arrow. Ship's manifest notes volatile munitions cargo on board. If left undisturbed, the ship's trajectory will lead to impact with Jonas. High probability the crash site will be Farragon, Jonas' largest human colony. Geth signatures detected aboard MSV Broken Arrow. <sighs> because of That's course. That's an issue. It's always yep. Geth. They never leave us alone. Mm -hmm. So let's try out Samara. And of course we're going to bring Tally to deal with Geth, right? Of course. Yellow. I'm moving the ship to yellow alert. While we've seen no sign of trouble, I'm not so sure we won't run into, into Geth this far out. We have to be prepared for anything. I've been told it's a terrible idea to go this far out toward Geth territory, but these colonies need to defend themselves. Sometimes I think the only thing keeping the crew from shriveling up in fear is the hundred crates of military-grade weaponry on board. A little shore leave when we get back to the Nyarp, Nyarp system will do us all some good. We have a lot of deliveries to make, and it's not going to get any friendlier out here. Red alert. Moving the ship to red alert. The Geth are attacking. We're ill-equipped for an attack of this magnitude, but we'll do everything we can to survive this. These colonies need those weapons, and this attack is further proof of how dire the situation is out here. This will be the last entry in this log. Given the severity of the Geth attack, I've ordered all hands to evacuate and head to the colony. Should the Geth succeed in capturing this ship, they will also gain control of the hundred crates of weapons in the cargo hold. Therefore, I'm using my authorization codes to scuttle the ship, hopefully destroying the Geth that remain aboard. I intend to stay aboard to make sure the ship dies gracefully. My plan is to disable the ship's engines, thus causing our orbit to decay. This will bring the MSV Broken Arrow down to the surface where the ship, where the self-destruct timer will destroy the ship. I must be careful. If I fail, there's no telling where the ship will end up. Good job there, Captain. Well, he definitely failed. Okay. Hopefully the time doesn't keep running while you're doing the mini game. Yeah. Navigation, offline, <laughs> life support, failing, engines disabled. So yeah, we should yeah. probably do something about those engines. Oh. Engine room seal. Oh, hit the override. Oh. Biotics. Still hilarious. <laughs> Yep. Motherfucker. Did I actually do? Reactivate one of the engine couplings. Oh, um, yeah, that's probably a useful. Can I get down here? No. That's not very legit. 
Now I have to get down over here. Busy here. And when the hell many get there? Are there not the famine things? More than a couple. And that's it. Side missions in this game got a little shorter, didn't they? That's a word for it. Stabilize MSV mm. arrow, remaining geth have disengaged. Colony is safe. I mean, the fact that you just get teleported back kinda helps. <coughs> Seriously. So, I do kind of understand the... understand this since it would be kind of annoying to work. Yeah. It was kind of annoying to walk back in a lot of those. Seriously. But at the same time, the ability to just look around and look would have been nice. Well, getting Samara on our side. She is so elegant and gorgeous. Too bad her manner is just so cold. Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Grant <coughs> seems very anxious, pacing down in the cargo hold. You might want to check in on him. Anything else, Commander? Yeah, maybe. That'll be all. I'll be here if you need anything. Well, let's check what the message over here is. Yeah. From Rafael Cologne, Governor of Farragon Colony, Jonas. Normandy crew, we retrieved your identity from docking data aboard MSV Broken Arrow. We le we're led to believe that your crew is responsible for saving our colony from a catastrophic event. Not only did you defeat the Geth and prevent the ship from crashing into the planet in a trajectory that would have destroyed our colony, but you've saved nearly a hundred munition crates that would have been lost in the ship's scuttling. Thanks to you, we are safe and can continue to Broken Arrow's work in arming the colonies on the fringe of Geth space. On behalf of residents of Farragon Colony, you have our eternal gratitude. Yay! Still alive, from Detective An Anaya. Greetings, Commander. I'm not completely sure this will get to you, but thanks again for helping me deal with Samara. The Eclipse Mercs have gotten real quiet around here, and my superiors have backed off too. No idea if the two are related, but hopefully the next time I meet a Justicar, I can give her the respect she deserves. I still can't believe I worked a case with one of them. You're a lucky human. If I have any more data on her target, I'll pass it along. Well, yeah, that's, that's really useful. That's nice of her. Yeah, that too. The other two messages were... Those are, those are the DLC related ones. Uh, uh, mm, nothing to see there. Not yet, at least. We'll get there, eventually. Kenny, what has the new shielding done to your power grid balance? Not much. With built-in capacitor subsystems, they have a surprisingly low draw. Doesn't that mean the shielding boost wouldn't last long under fire? True. They're built for hard, fast strikes, not firefights of attrition. Hmm. Good. We missed the line for when, for when Jack first comes aboard because Gabby basically just goes, so there's a woman squatting in the, in the sub deck. Gah, I hope, I swear if she touches anything. And then she chimes in, she's wear, and, and she wears nothing but tattoos and belts above her waist. Well, maybe I should go introduce myself to her. She's also a psychopathic killer and was and was pulled from a prison ship. Gah, stop messing with me, woman. <laughs> <coughs> All right, Grunt, what's the deal? They get that lost so well. Mm-hmm. Chambers said you're tearing up the place. Something wrong? Something is wrong, Shepard. I feel wrong, tense. I just want to kill something with my hands more so than usual like it's not my choice like I just want to I don't know Ooh. see why do that what's wrong Okir didn't imprint anything to help you figure this out I see pictures of old battles 
voices of warlords. But this is a blood haze in my head. I want control. When we're moving, fighting, I focus. But here, my blood screams, my plates itch, and even you are just noise. I'm tank-born. What is this? Don't know if I can help, Fred. Sounds like we need one of your kind to look into this. Most off-world Krogan are warriors. Doctors don't leave the homeworld to Chanka. I won't then I guess we're going to the Chanka. I will control this. Joker can get us to the Krogan homeworld. I need everyone at their best. Thank you, Shepard. I don't like this. Fury is my choice, not a sickness. Well said. I wonder, Zai got anything clever to say? Back for another lesson. Sure. Tough yeah. fight on the horizon. I fought slavers and kidnapping rings, but nothing like that. Some slavers took a little girl on a colony in the Skepsis system. Girl woke up, fought her way out, got picked up by my band while on the way to Omega. Eight years old. Should have had no chance on Horizon. I mean... Correct. Get a knife stuck in the right way. And you can pull that plate right off a of Krogan's head. It's the best way to get a Krogan to talk. The threat of it drives a man. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Have you told Grunt that one yet? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it will go over so well. I mean, no need to make enemies, so... Can I get... No, still can't get the cane yet. Hmm. One more heavy weapon ammo upgrade. What did that training do again? I forgot. It just lets me ch choose a bonus power. Hmm. And you... I mean, it would replace whatever you already have, right? Yeah, which in this case is barrier. So, not like it, but it. Yeah. Anything else you can upgrade? I keep saying the availability numbers and it makes me think that there's more than there actually are. Medbay upgrade, which is useless. Oh, right, it's because we don't have the money. Yeah, we don't have the material. And yeah, we could. I don't know. We should. I guess we should save up. Yeah. Oh, conveniently, there's a um, heavy weapon ammo, heavy weapon up, ammo upgrade on a Junka. Cool. You know where we're already going to be going. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. I'm not sure what the best way to just make a lot of credits for Vito. It's because in this game, credits are made differently. You can't just go out and kill stuff. Uh, you get it from the hacking and from. Uh, error, loading, and from mission completions. Now, I meant to go to Omega, so let's actually do that. Omega it is. You see that brief loading moment where I'm like, wait, this isn't the Omega system. <laughs> Minor details. Tiny, tiny detail, but yes. And it literally does not matter because we're just here to pick something up. Oh. Now let's see, heavy disruptor or squad disruptor? Heavy. Yeah. Now we're getting to the point where, where we're getting fully evolved powers. What do you think, heavy or area? Mm, what does the overload do again? It's an electromagnetic pulse on shields and synthetics. Oh, okay. And then, let's see, what was the rest of the tip? Okay, what's the other one? 
Oh, that's a difficult one. Mm -hmm. <coughs> but I think area. Alright, area it is. Since they're not necessarily going to be... That's not what I want to do. Special. Oh, you can't undo auto level up. Oh well, guess she's got heavy war overload. What? When I'm bad, I'm bad. So we'll see. Yes, I was saying, uh, since the moment is actually going to be close together, the chance to hit more of them at that time is probably better than the chance that they will happen to explore next to a uh, marine. I don't have to look into that quest. I remember it being funky. Shut up, Batarian. Is there any actual progress we can do to that thing? To what thing? Just under the prophet or whatever. No, he just keeps ranting. Okay, that's just one there. Hey, remember this little salvage shop from that was run by the Corian? Yeah. That sounds useful. How much did that cost? Mm, a pittance. If oh. you don't remember, that's what the, that's what the engineers wanted us to buy. Uh, yeah, that'd be useful. Quite. And. Anything else to do in Omega? Mm. Not yet. There's other stuff. Oh. Something like that? Yeah. I guess that's also the other set of stuff. No. It's just. You I'm just, just don't care. No, oh no. I'm just saving it for later because different dialogue that I've never heard. Oh, huh. good enough. Right, so should we go get Thane, or should we head to Tachunka? Oh, that's a difficult one. That's a difficult one. Let's go get Thane. Okay, there it is. The find the icon. <laughs> right, back down the... Well, so... God damn it. There we go. Since we're here... We need more stuff. Thank you. Now let's see. Who should we bring this time? Mm -hmm. Dali? And, um, let's bring Samara just to throw them. <laughs> Even more. Okay, then. Which one do you think we should upgrade? Drone or hacking? Drone. Attack drone or explosive drone? Mm. What does explosive do? Attack drone. Hmm. Board field. Is this about to say big yeet or group yeet? Group yeet. <laughs> Excuse me, my sources indicate you were in a warehouse recently. Did you by any chance forward a questionable shipping note to a Mr. Thax? It looked suspicious, so I passed it on. I'm a representative for Mr. Thax. He's very grateful to you. Please accept this as a gift for bringing the shipping irregularities to his attention. What happens to the shipping agent who is cheating Thax? That depends on how sincere her apology is, and how willing she is to correct a mistake. Do you want help finding the person who cheated Thax? Thank you, but that won't be necessary. Mr. Thax will be making a series of polite calls. 
Hopefully a confrontation will not be required. It was my pleasure. Get them. Have a pleasant day. To add to the things you never thought you'd see, but you see on Ilium, uh, <coughs> a polite Krogan. Alright. What that actually does you have a pleasant day. I know, right? So let's see, what, what have we seen on Ilium we didn't expect? Uh, Krogan poetry. Polite Krogan. The list just goes on, doesn't it? Yep. And you know, there's some prestigious thing, of course, just them just being here at all. Yeah. I need minimal heat increase. And speed. I have extremely high performance requirements. Certainly, sir. Safe, too. I need a 100% safety guarantee of anything going on to my suit. The people here are asked to sacrifice their own convictions and beliefs in exchange for a soulless corporate identity. I understand that kind of life would be attractive to some people, but not to me. I mean, I guess to some people, yeah. But I gotta agree, not to me. Hey, at least she isn't just immediately shooting everyone on site. No, because I haven't told her to yet. <laughs> I'm surprised the name Nasana Dantius hasn't uh, tripped you. I was in the middle of trying to remember where... Uh, she was the Asari diplomat we met fairly early on who had a sister that was a slaver. Uh, uh, like at the beginning of the first game. Uh, yeah. She was going to have a set us up to go kill her sister under the pretense that she was captured by the slaver, but we kind of yeah. found all that beforehand. I guess she hasn't gotten much of a be gotten much gotten any better in the past two years, huh? So it would seem. Serena. Who wants to know? Name Shepard. Liara Tassoni said you might have information on Thane Krios. Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? Maybe you could help me find him? <laughs> I can tell you, but you won't stop him. When he contacted me, I checked up on him. The man never gives up on a job. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. Why does that name sound familiar? She was a representative on the Citadel a few years ago. Right. She had me kill her sister, the slaver. I thought that was just a rumor. Well, you know what she's capable of then. She has even more power here in Nos Astra. She uses it to keep her friends in check, and her enemies dead. If you work there, you must well, have an idea she what's for now. <laughs> Eclipse Mercs, high-tech killer. Undisciplined, but very well equipped. They don't much care who they kill, as long as they're paid for it. Thane has quite a reception waiting for him. I told him all I knew. He didn't seem worried. So where do I find Thane? The Dantius Towers. Penthouse level of Tower 1. There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. I'll find him. Not without some help. You don't just walk into the Dantius Towers, especially now. But you've got a way in. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. Do you know anything else about Thane? Not much. He did say that he's not doing the hit for money. Nobody hired him. I wanted to know who I was helping, and he said he's doing this job on his own. That he had to restore the balance of his life. I don't know. Maybe he's crazy. If he takes down Asana, I don't care why he does it. You're just off right now. No strings attached? You're going to look for Thane. Nasana's mercenaries will try to stop you. At the least, you'll distract her guards. Take a little fire, give Thane a clear shot. I didn't hire him to kill Nasana, but I won't shed any tears when she gets what's coming to her. Let's go then. <laughs> I'm, good. I'm tired of this crap. We'll go tonight, as soon as the shift workers clear out of Tower 2. Alright then. 
She didn't really hate anyone, but she really wants the hair there. And she wouldn't mind if Dane succeeded, though. Yeah. So let's get to it. Guarded and you'll find more resistance closer to the Pantos. So, this assassin, you planning to stop him? I'm just here to make sure he survives. Hmm. It's usually when I just break a few traffic laws. There they are, the Dante's Towers. You'll have to get up to the second tower and cross the bridge to the Penthouse. Her mercs will fight you every step, but it's your best chance. We might find him before it goes that far. Maybe. At least you'll know where he's headed. Any last-minute tips about the towers? The Eclipse Mercs will be well fortified by now, and they won't want to disappoint Nasana. There's no automated defenses or traps, just focus on anything moving. All right. Let's do this. Hold on. Good luck, Shepard. Side real quick. No. Okay. Let's go. Ah. Why is my mouse so sensitive at times? <laughs> nope. Nothing. Okay. Get off the wall, moron. Wow, you're not dead? Help. He's alive, barely. I can't feel my legs. My chest is killing me. Who did this to you, and why? We're just night workers. Nasana sent them after us. She sent the mechs to round us up, but we didn't hear. They just started shooting. They just attacked you? Yes. They were too slow. It was horrible. Everyone screaming. The mercs said there was no time. Sana wanted us out of the way. Immediately. Then... <coughs> the dogs... <coughs> he needs medical attention, Shepard. Here. That should ease the pain and keep you alive until help arrives. Thank you. That helps. Take your time. I think I'm better. Find the other workers. Help them. I need to get up to the penthouse. Any suggestions? Take the service elevator yeah. to the upper floors. The bridge between the towers isn't finished, but if you're careful, watch out for the mercs. They're everywhere. Any idea how many mercs Nasana's got? A lot. Dozens of them are wandering around here all day. You'll find more the further up you go. Why would Nasana kill her own workers? Her were expendable, but I didn't realize she was that ruthless. My friends, co-workers, slaughtered. They were jumping off ledges to escape the dogs. I'm not sure if that would help very much. I'll do what I can. One death for another. Thank you. Yeah, at least just what kills you, right? Kills you quickly, to be precise. That too. Alright. Hey, with some nine impossible luck, you might find something to grab onto. <laughs> eh, there's nothing too hard about that. Anyway, we've got a long climb ahead of us. 
So, let's take a quick break. Mm -hmm. Come back to do mm -hmm. that next time. Yep. And I mean, I'll take 0.01% 0 .01 chances to 0.00% chances. And with that, we'll catch you later. Bye-bye.